what I don't like about Leslie. Every day, like when I sit in his car, he drives like a freaking F1 driver and like he's very very aggressive on the road. I, she just hates my driving. I think I, I, I think I'm a very very good driver. It's quite annoying when he like leaves his, his things like lying around on the floor, like especially when he just come home from work and then he'll just like he will like throw his like pants and like his belt and his cufflinks and his wallet like all around like randomly scattered around the house like leaving a trail of things. Definitely because I have son. Uh. Definitely like me because I'm handsome, that's for sure. Uh, I'm cute and adorable and I'm very, very funny. very funny and he's always like he always has like funny funny jokes to tell like tell people around him and he always has he's I think he, at one point he even like has a notebook where he like actually jots down like notes so that he remembers jokes and he can like tell his friends like when the time is right and all that so yeah I think he's the kind of person who likes to bring a lot of joy to people's lives and like make people laugh and make people smile um, overall, he's just a very um, sweet person and he's very thoughtful and um, he will actually like go the extra mile to like, you know, make sure that I'm comfortable or like I'm happy. So I think for that, he's really a um, very, a very good boyfriend. So, well, if you ask me what kind of person she is, I think she's very shameless. She'll always say, wow, I'm very chill, eh. oh, I'm very, very good. I'm, like if we have a good meal, she'll say, oh, it's because I make this decision, it's because I, I make the call, I, make the, I decide. And this is how she makes it. Like. It's a love, 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 love. I really don't know because like he's always complaining like how I'm this, how I'm that, how I like to nag, how I um he's always saying all the bad things but I think other than all the bad things everything is good. And an empty so 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 I believe if you ask me I think we are a couple that are actually um we don't really care about our personal image sometimes. We actually uh, like to do funny, funny things, make people laugh. We like to be like like the life and the party of like life of the party, I would say. Or more like um, like the fun of it. Like we like to do things to make people happy. We like to entertain people, we like to joke, we like to make fun of each other, we like to sing. This is this is what we are. We always like to we always are very entertaining and we love to eat. So we always like to bring friends. Uh, to eat uh, anywhere we go, whether, whether we are going overseas, whether we are in Singapore, anywhere we go, we always try to bring our friends to have good food and share with them our experiences. That's what I think that makes us unique in that sense. Both of us also like to travel a lot, and like I think recently we just took up diving. Yeah, more towards like trying out new experiences and uh, just mm, just living on a jet plane and like you know just the feeling of like being in some place else that's not familiar to us and like not Singapore you know some place that we can soak up you know the culture and like look at new architecture and like try out new food and like just people watching you know like I think. That's something that we really enjoy doing, and I can see us see I can see us doing it like for like many many years to come. Yeah. Why her? If you were to ask me, uh, at the end of the day, I would say that she's like a best friend to me. Uh, no matter what happens, I know that she she will always be there for me. Uh, 
be it through good and bad times, uh, she can be nagging at me, she can be, can be making, making a very big scene about a certain thing, but at the end of the day, I know that she, she really cares about me. And, and when we first met, we, I, I was actually uh, just like an NSF, I only, only like, like maybe like, maybe one fifth or one sixth of her income. And she stood by me since from, from I was like nobody to where I am today. And, I, and without her, I probably would not be able to be, be where I am right now. With all her support and all her constant encouragement or nagging, if you want to put it that way. But end of the day, it's that it's not it's the journey that the end of the day is the journey that, that mattered to me. You see. That's why it's like she has been there for me through thick and thin. She's been there for me through the ups and downs of my life, of my career, and I really, honestly, I really don't know what to do if she's not there anymore for me. And I re I remember once I actually read somewhere before they said that actually you should be you you should marry someone that you can't live without, not someone that you want to live with. And she's someone that I really can't live without. So that's the reason why I chose her. I'll write you a poem It will tell the tale um, I would say um, thank you for for being like everything you are mm, for for tolerating my quirks and for for being to able for being able to you know like to handle me, like I, I know that like sometimes I'm quite difficult to like to 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 read and like difficult to please, like what everybody thinks. So thank you for, for always like trying to make me happy and trying to like give me what I want. And thanks for you know like always like doing doing things for me for thinking for us and and always being there to help me like with, with anything mm. I feel I feel very I feel very blessed to have you and I can't I can't think of like anyone else that you know like I want to do this with Yeah, that's all. Did I to love you till the end of time? B, I know that you'll be eager to know what I want to say to you, but you know how irritating I am, so I want to tell you this only on our actual day. I always knew that I had to till the end of time. I'll keep your heart with mine. I want to thank you for being my inside through the ups and downs of my life since I was an FF to where I am today. For your constant nagging on everything I do, but I know that it's because you care about me. There is not enough words to describe what I'm feeling right now, but I can tell you that you're one of the most important reasons in my life. What, you always ask me what I love most about you, but I can tell you that I love you so much that I can't live without you. And today, I want to take this opportunity to let, remind you how much I really, really love you. And let's start living the rest of our lives together.